Now hear this, right? Everybody has been talking about life after death and, you know, Jesus Christ and, you know, I am ready to die if you're ready. And, you know, everybody talking about, about them kind of thing. But, you know, the reality and the truth is nobody really wants to die, you know. The reality of this life is no one really wants to die. And especially when something puts you in a limited predicament, you really don't sit down and study to die. You know what does make some people feel to die? Pain. Emotional pain does make you want to die, make you want to take your own life, make you want to do some, some kind of thing that we would say and call it foolish things. You know, but the reality is nobody wants to die. People would be stricken with, you know, incurable diseases and so forth. And they, there's a period of time they would be fighting for life. They want to live. But when the pain and the situations get overbearing and overwhelming, people just say, listen, I want to give up this life and die. And... You know we're looking at them but, but, but what about those that are healthy And claiming they know Jesus And they know spirituality No matter what area of spirituality You belong to Let me tell you something Nobody wants to die Everybody wish they could stay here And turn stone The, the catch to that is that Some people start to understand The purpose our life. Some people start to, as they start to mature, they, they start to understand transition. As they mature, they start to understand that we are on a journey. As they start to mature, you start to understand here what's going on. As much as, as much as this is a life that we live in here, it had to have something that we're missing. You know, it come like you, you, you go by a family and spend some time and no matter how comfortable they, they, they make you, you just want to go home. You know, once you're home, you have certain things that you just want to go home. Everybody like their own home. And, and really and truly, this is what's happening here. We on vacation in this body on this earth and we want to go home. Because as, as, as I would said, we are a spiritual body on an earthly journey, not an earthly body with our spiritual journey we we are just spending time in this body and the truth is whether we like it or not this body can't take more than it could take and and, and that is why this body does does do something that they call get old get weary get worn you understand it come like you're you're driving on a tire and that tire will get worn come uh, and tell you how to take it off is the same thing yeah, you know, yeah, you have on clothes, you have shoes. Once you keep using something, it's going to tell that the time is is is, is reaching to a point where you just had to change it, and that's what happened with this body. Sometimes you beat up this body so much in so many different ways that this body starts to want to give up before even time, so that. Uh, uh, the you inside your body in a certain condition but your body can't take it because you beat up your body so here we are saying you know let me don't fool yourself don't, don't come and give me no Christian thing about who oh, I have to be absent in the body is to be present with God you and know you're going to be no present with God you still trying to come to a place where you could feel that you have earned Hallelujah, you you still trying to come to a place where you believe you would have earned the right to spend a certain uh, place and time with a certain um, a certain authority and privilege to go to a, a, another place which is, is beyond. Right, but the truth is that you are really you are really am. Um, you are really accepting that just so because you see it has always been as something that you thought that you'd be able to finish do it but it always has something you want to do 
But you know, when you come and you understand you're restricted, you just know that here we're going on, you just have to accept it. So, you know, let me remember that nobody really wants to die. But to die, we have to lay this body down because this body is terrestrial and we are really celestial beings. Tune in for part two.